Hello guys, welcome to this video. In this video, our question is: Find the amount and the compound interest on rupees two thousand in two years. If the rate of interest is four percent for the first year and three percent for the second year. So this is our question on a survey. So the first year, all the information that are being given. So first year, our principal that is equal to rupees two thousand. Now the rate one is equal to given four percent for the first year, so we have four percent. And rate two will be equal to three percent for the second year. So rate one is four percent, and rate two is three percent. And time is given two years. So in this question, time doesn't matter. So, so we will write that the amount is equal to the formula will be principal into one plus r by r one by hundred into one plus r two by hundred. So if you solve this, we will get the amount. So in this question, time is not needed. So the principal two thousand into one plus r one means four by hundred into one plus r two means one three by hundred. So equal to two thousand into so one by four plus hundred. It we take hundred as the LCM. Now hundred into one is hundred plus four, and here also hundred as the LCM. Hundred into one hundred plus three. So it becomes two thousand. Into now hundred plus four is equal to hundred four by hundred into hundred three by hundred. So you got the zeros. So it remains two into one hundred four into one hundred three by ten. So you are keeping ten and not cutting it as it will be easier to calculate it. So now two into one hundred four into one hundred three it becomes two into one zero four in zero six. So one hundred four into one hundred three becomes one hundred one zero four zero six by ten. So now we can easily now multiply it by two. So two into one zero four into zero six it becomes two zero eight one two. So it is two into one zero four zero six by ten now. So by ten, that we all know that it will go to one decimal place. That means after two. So the final amount is two zero eight one point two. So as it is in rupees, it gives one more zero. So therefore, this is our final answer. I mean the final amount. So now I have to find out the compound interest. So I write that compound interest is equal to the formula is amount the minus the principal. So amount we got is two zero eight one point two zero minus the principal that is two thousand. So it becomes rupees eighty one point two zero. So the amount for this question is two thousand eighty one point two zero, and the compound interest for this question is eighty one point two zero. So this is our final answer for this question. So guys, thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe my channel for more solution.